Dwayne, we've got so many questions coming in for all of you guys, but I have to start with uh, this comment from Dave for you. Dwayne Johnson on The One Show seems like a fever dream. <laughs> Who made it happen and how? Uh, and that's exactly what we need to talk about because uh, we are very excited to talk about your new Not film. only is it a dream, but it's a fever dream. It's yes. a fever <laughs> dream. That's a, that's a big deal. It's yeah. just so exciting. So Black Adam, DC's latest blockbuster, and yes. follows the story of Teth Adam. He's a superhero, but he's not cut from the usual mould. He's unlike any other. Tell us a little bit about Teth. You, you play him. I did. I had the honour of bringing Black Adam to life, and this has been, as, as Noah will tell you too as well, this has been a 15-year-long journey of fighting to get Black Adam made. Uh, oh, so oh, okay. what, a, uh, what an honour it was not only to get Black Adam made and to become Black Adam, but also uh, to build out the DC universe that we love and that fans all around the world love and introduce five new uh, superheroes in one movie. And one of them, Adam Smasher, sitting right here to my left and the rest of the JSA. Uh, so it's a really, really exciting time. And I, I have been saying this, and this is the truth, I've been really lucky and fortunate over the course of my career um, to have done some pretty good things. Black Adam is the most important film I have ever made. Uh, yeah. And certainly the biggest, but the, really the most important. 15 years of fighting, something you believe so deeply passionate about. So it's really gratifying to be here and getting ready to release it to the world. That's, that's, that's incredible. And you've got a great cast as well. And Noah, I want to talk about your superhero, Atom Smasher. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of in the name, isn't it? He's always smashing into things. I did hear there is a rumour going around that you were a little bit clumsy on set. Uh, yeah, 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 that did happen. Because yeah. of the mask. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, I don't, I, he's I, not my, a clumsy guy. My peripheral vision <laughs> is thrown. It was a hand-me-down. I'm trying to get it tailored. Look at but, that. I mean, there he is. Yeah, I was, uh, I was running and I, I thought, well, we've done it five times, this will be the sixth. Why don't, why don't I try to make it funny? And I made it real funny. <laughs> I okay. pretended to hit something and spun around and dislocated my arm. And oh. it was fine. They oh. took 13 tries. They popped it back in. I got oh. so excited, it went back in. I, I Twice. celebrated and then it went out again. Oh. Yeah. 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 Why, why not celebrate? And look, God, if it was the funniest thing you'd ever want to see on set, guys. I laughed so hard. He <laughs> popped his shoulder out twice. <laughs> uh, Dwayne, how did it feel the first time you got to put on the full kit? And, and did you get to keep it? Well, I got to tell you, it, Lauren, it was, a, it was a real, putting on that costume, it was a real moment. I had a real moment, again, 15 years of something you believe in, pushing it, pushing it, pushing it, you finally get it made. Day one, I put it on in my trailer, I take a look in the mirror, I have a moment uh, where it's like, this is it, this is it. I step outside, I go to set, I go to our director, Jama Colette Serra, we're talking, and he goes, how do you feel? I said, I feel uh, just really grateful, man, let's go make a great movie. Just like that, I look up and I see Noah and the rest of our cast, Aldous Hodge, uh, Quintessa Swindell, Pierce Brosnan, all in their costumes, all walking towards me. And that was that was the moment. That's when I knew. Like, that's a fever dream. That's, 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 that's a fever dream. <laughs> yeah. Here come the JSA. So it was really awesome. And I didn't get to keep it, though. Oh. Uh, I can, but... Well, I mean, that's, that's kind of... A lot of people have actually been asking, I and mean, we've had a question in uh, from Mitchell. This is for you, Noah. Uh, Noah, did you, did you get to keep or did you steal anything from set? I, uh, I didn't get to keep anything. I did steal some, some fingers. I'm not going to tell you who's... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you got to give context. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Go watch the, the show's live. Yeah. <laughs> we might, we might need more on that. Okay, so one of the characters... Something happens, and um, there's, a, there's a burnt body, and, mm -hmm. and we did this, you know, the scene involved in the party. It actually, it actually got cut out of it, and... Um, and I because you stole, stole the fingers. fingers. <laughs> <laughs> like, where They're going to find them for fingers? continuity, <laughs> is what it was. But I have them, and they're at my house, mm. and I cherish them. Very good, I mean, Dwayne. I mean, you must have so many films over the years. He's like, great, let's get off of this one. <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I mean, don't, don't, don't get taken off <laughs> there. Years. Family show. Family <laughs> show. We're talking about fingers. Um, uh, Dwayne, uh, you know, so many films. What 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 have you taken from your movies of years gone by? Do you have a favorite that you have at home? Uh, a, a favorite thing that I do have at home is um, the very first movie I did. I starred in Scorpion King many moons ago. I have the sword um, from that movie. Oh, wow. No, I'm, I, I'm sorry. It was actually the sword from The Mummy Returns, which I had a cameo in. Yeah. And that was my very first um, ever movie. We were in the Sahara Desert. Uh, I had one line, Aku Mashente. I'll never forget it. And I throw the sword, Aku Mashente, and it's a really cool shot. 
And in that language, it means, I'm in the movie for two seconds. <laughs> <laughs> And then I have that sword. So. How many times you told that joke, DJ? <laughs> I know, too, too many. <laughs> I love that. I mean, Noah, what was it like keeping up with Dwayne in the gym and, that's, you know... That's very sweet of you. Keep, uh, keeping up. <laughs> <laughs> very sweet. Thank you. Thank I you. I mean... There's no... He there's not even a comparison. Everyone, everyone works super hard. They came on set. And they were... Again, this was an opportunity for all of us because this is the... There's no reference to any of these superheroes prior to us. Mm. No other actors have played them, so... It's up to us, and you got to be accountable, man. And these guys work their butts off. There's a responsibility for sure that, yes. that we all felt. I know, I know, uh, every single one of us. And Aldis actually showed up months before we ever set action for the first time, and he was trained. He was up at 4 a.m. training by five for a few hours, doing stunt work, doing wire work, nonstop for months before we started shooting. Right. So, Dwayne has this unique ability to instill his own passion in other people and to team build in such a way that allows his vision to be executed properly. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, I mean, one of the things that I think I feel like I hope that I've been able to pick up from you is your ability to team oh, build. completely, it. man. He's... But we all took it very seriously. Good man. So. Romance is so nice. Yeah, it's all right, though. There, there, is, there. there is something I, I, I would, I've always wanted to ask personally about, about you know, superhero movies. Now, when, if you were filming something like The Scorpion King, for instance, mm -hmm. you'd be doing stunts that are all like, you know, you're practicing your sword fighting and, and fist fighting, etc. In superhero films, do you actually... Now, tell me if I'm doing this right. Are no. you practicing going... Anyway. <laughs> are you practicing going... <laughs> and just pushing away uh. lightning bolts? How do you perfect the lightning bolt push? Ah, uh, well, I deliver lightning bolts. Yes. 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 So, but yeah, you have to go through the motion. Is there any way you could show me a lightning belt pose? Are you sure? Yes, please. Are you ready? I would dangerous. love to. Lauren, should I do this? Oh, please. Yes, Rob? please. I'm nervous, but okay. yeah. Should I? It's going to be painful. Oh, but yeah. Right. Thank, Thank you, guys. That's good. So, a no lightning belt pose would be what? You better be ready, bro. You ready? Yeah. From here, like you're a, a gunslinger. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, it's a lot okay. more subtle than I think. Let me see you do it. Okay. Mm. Uh, you gotta snap it a little bit more. Just a little snap. <clears throat> oh. Hey. Ooh. That's constipated. Um. <laughs> That's where I was going wrong. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's where I was going wrong. <laughs> <laughs>